Hello, procrastinators, and welcome back to Nerd Cubes Bricking It. Today is like the final set of vehicles I have. Oh, slightly angled camera this time. My hands might get in the way a lot. Uh, today is the final set of vehicles uh, that I have that I had before I started this series up. So from now on, it'll be sort of new stuff that I pick up. I still have some buildings and stuff, and I've got to do a video on each one of these modular buildings uh, before we. Um, uh, before I get through everything that I had before we started, but we're going to do some sort of new stuff. I do have a lot of... I buy Lego regularly enough that we can keep doing this, but this is sort of the end of the older Lego that I have. So it's kind of... it's like the last set that will actually... everything will fit together, and it'll be like, hey, here's the theme. From now on, it's sort of going to be, hey, here's what I bought. Okay, good. First up, meow, a police truck. Da -da -da -da. So yes, this is a lovely little police truck. Thinking about it now, I think this came with like a go-kart or something. Hang on a second. I'm gonna go through my Lego drawers. No, small vehicles. Where's my small vehicle? Small vehicle drawer! Oh, I think it was this. Now, don't quote me on this. Yes, I have a small vehicle Lego drawer. Shut your fucking face. I think this came with it as well, this set, because it was sort of an escape one. Because this has a little grappling hook thing on the back, and you were supposed to be able to put it in there, and then... Yeah, okay, there, there we go, sorry. My hand was in the way. This is, uh, this is like, in really loosely. It's got a little flap, so it comes out real easy. So it's like an escape, and this was an escape, the baddie, please. It's a, it's a lot of crime. A lot of crime in Lego City for some reason. I don't know why. Uh, so yes, this is a little go-kart. Uh, have we got any minifigures? Uh, <laughs> sorry. I've opened my minifig drawer, which is down here. And at the very top of it, just just found my brick separators. <laughs> Woo, from my bigger sets. I've made some sort of creepy spine thing. I'll put that over there. Uh, do we have any police in here in this one? We have a lovely man in a top hat. We have me as Night Snake. We have lots of... We have Emmett! Hey, Emmett! Oh, girl holding mince pie. A horse. Oh, there's a police officer! Hey! There we go. So this is the, uh, hang on. He thinks he, <laughs> he thinks his key is a phone. He's like, yeah. What's that? What's that, Captain Key? Yes, he has a... This is a police officer from Lego City. They're just all the same, pretty much. Do we have any more? I, I, I have loads of them. There's another one. He's a little bit more cheeky, but I have no idea what comes with what sets because some of these were like advent calendar things and some of these were like, ooh, look at me, I'm with a proper set. Got any robbers, got any baddies? Ah, perfect example of robber baddie. Yeah, and all the robber baddies kind of look a bit like this. Like little tiny mustachioed bandana wearing bastards. Or they look sort of like this. We're all like, yeah, I'm holding a bar of gold. No idea which ones came with this set, but that's the thing. Go cut. Hang on. There we go. Go cut thing. Yeah, this is like the most escapable police cell because both of the windows on both sides can come out. The uh, the back opens like this. Fuck. Like this. And the top. <laughs> this is the most escapable police cell of all time. Well done, lad. This is why there's so much crime because they never actually convict anyone. They always just escape. But it's nice. Bit of uh, heavy stick work, you can see. No, I'm not a huge fan of white Lego because it tends to go that slightly yellow colour even if you had it for a little while and it's never as white as the stickers so they really stand out that that's a sticker there. But yeah, that's quite a nice set. You and you, go over there because we need a bit of space because these next two are really fucking big. Right, first up, we have a Jeep. And a boat! This is a Jeep boat set. We'll do the boat first. Shwing. It just sort of sits on there. Yes, this is a... Slightly in focus. There we go. This is a police boat with its laser guns. Actually, I believe they're supposed to go up. But I had this in a drawer, so they were down. Uh, it's just a little boat thing. I kind of... I always wanted to get a Lego boat, and I was kind of disappointed because it was very... Um, well, as you can see, the, the, whole, the whole base of the boat is just one piece. A single piece. And I was like, oh, that's sad, but then I found out that they float. You can put this in one room, it's like, oh yeah, real boat. So I suppose the play factor outweighs the fun building factor on this one. And it has its little, at the back, it's got little engines that they can, you can fold them down and be all like, Ooh. I do like that pretty much everything that should spin does spin in LEGO. That's probably why I like LEGO, the fact stuff spins. And yes, with its laser beamy things, that's a boat. The little trailer itself. Not much to speak about, it's just sort of a trailer. It has a nice winch attached to this, which you have to put a sticker on. And, hmm, the angled approach is slightly odd. I'll have to rethink how I do this. And then we twisty, 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 and it goes away. Oh, hang on, wrong way. Twisty, 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 and then, yes, that goes over there. And you can hook the boat's ass to it. Oh, you can actually, because the boat has a, a hole on the thing, it sort of fits over that bit quite nicely there. And then you can just attach the hook, the hook, attach the hook 
to the top. Ta-da! And now your boat is secure. And you can fasten, 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 pull your boat on, and then that back bit doesn't work anymore because I didn't put the boat far forward enough. And now it's attached to there. Brilliant plan, me! I'm good at this! Hang on. You could ah, pull that to separate it off. That can go over there. And this bit is a sort of police jeep and majig. It doesn't really... Oh, actually, I was about to say, it doesn't really do much, but it does have a little antennae thingy in it. In fact, if I'm right, this whole bit here comes out. I hope I remember rightly. Oh, I remembered wrongly. Oh, but it's got a drawer. It must come out. These must be designed to come out, because it has a little drawer. Otherwise, the drawer is behind and sealed off, as you can see in there. See? Can't open that. So, yes, there's a little police thing. It looks slidey. Maybe it slides out. Ah, oh, the whole thing's... Ah, oh, see? This is me not paying attention to myself. Woo, look, the whole thing slides out. Something in there. Oh, there's some life jackets in there. How, how safe of them. And a little sonar. So this is like a little boat set with a mug. Don't know why they always have mugs. They drink a lot of coffee and they don't catch a lot of criminals in Lego City. Is that, that's the most political thing anyone's ever said about Lego City. But yeah, police boat, jeep. Anyway, that's the thing. And then... We have something that's a bit like something we saw earlier in an earlier episode, which is the giant, massive, fucking super truck thing. But we have the sort of smaller, regular police version of the Observe truck. Observe! Oh, the whole thing rocked there, that was amazing. Da 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 da! And focus. Focus? Fo that'll do. So yes, this is a little thing. It's way less detailed than the other one, which folds out and is amazing. This is just a. Uh, Laptops up as well. So you can sit your people in there and they can drink from their coffee machine. They always have coffee machines. And there's nice fun stickers about tracking people and being all creepy in government surveillance. -y. If I'm right, when I got back into Lego, this was like one of the first ever sets that I got. And it was quite nice. This was around the time that um, the NSA story was really big. So I really liked that for Christmas I was given a nice spying surveillance van. That made me giggle a lot. And there's a little cute wanted poster. Uh, flap that down, flap that in there. Inside here, we have a single traffic cone. Really, a single traffic cone, because that's where I sort of like to keep that thing. There is a, oh, where does this one go? Does this open up sort of a back area? There's a tiny storage area in the back of that truck. That's very nice. And then in the front, it's standard truck malarkeys. And at the back, you have a little place to store prisoners that is most likely incredibly escape frommable. But yes, and a radar that spins falls off. But yeah, that's the Lego Police Force. Uh, that's all the policey stuff I have. Next time we will be going through some newer things that I have recently, recently, recently purchased. That I've recently purchased. Yes. Oh, battle crash. <laughs>